Hello, I'm High Heel Knight. Welcome to my channel. This is my first impressions of Avengers Endgame. I just got back from the theater. I saw it first showing. I wanted to avoid spoilers. And would you believe it, despite my uh, dodging the internet and dodging social media and dodging uh, interviews and dodging commercials, right before the movie started, I was hanging outside the uh, auditorium and someone said, a minor spoiler. It didn't ruin the movie for me, but I was just thinking, oh, come on. I was dodging and dodging and dodging and dodging. <laughs> but fortunately, it didn't ruin the experience for me, but I was yeah, a little frustrated with that. So, about this movie, I will give a full review uh, when I am able. Right now, I am still processing information, just like I did with Infinity War. In fact, that's the reason why I started doing uh, smaller uh, mini reviews, because I was so devastated and amazed by Infinity War. I just had to get my mind to process what happened and just make some type of video. So uh, just with uh, that first movie, hey, I might as well uh, keep it tradition with Avengers Endgame just to help me coordinate my mind. <laughs> uh, I will say it's extremely satisfying. Going into this movie, I try to have next to no uh, significant expectations even though obviously Marvel has done very well over the past uh, 10 plus years. But still, I was just thinking, how are they going to make a three-hour movie about this? Because they don't really promote any other villain or conflict. I mean, there's Thanos, but, you know, all of his children were destroyed in the uh, first movie. So I was like, how are you really going to make three hours out of it? Well, they do make three hours out of it. And in my, miraculously, it doesn't drag. And... Brandon, you need to be in there awake, okay? <laughs> Don't go in there and sleep because you will fall asleep to sit down and exhaustion. But no, it, it, it is wonderful. It is thrilling. And unlike the first movie where you don't have to have seen all the other films before, with this one, you don't have to have seen all the other films. But it's really, 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 really helpful if you did. If you've been on the journey for the whole uh, 10 plus years, or if you know you've seen all sorts, you've seen as much as you can. The more you've seen, the better. <laughs> I'll leave it at that. Now, uh, just some consumer information, and I'm sharing this. I, some might consider this a spoiler, but I'm, hey, it's three hour movie plus twenty to twenty five minutes of previews. I think you should know whether or not you should say for the credits. So, consumer information. If you don't want to say for the credits, you don't have to. And that's all I'm going to say. <laughs> uh, and you might be disappointed that I'm telling you this. And I'm also going to tell you that regardless of what you feel about this movie, you are probably going to walk away with a disappointment or something that upsets you or something that makes you sad or something that frustrates you. But the overall experience should be wonderful for you. It, it's This is just an absolutely phenomenal, amazing movie. But there's bound to be at least one thing that irks you. And it's designed to be that way. It's designed to say that, hey, this is going to come at a price. <laughs> it's not just the ticket price. There's going to be an emotional price to pay for going to see this movie and uh, going on this uh, 10 plus long journey. So yeah, wonderful movie. Definitely loved it. Definitely enjoyed it. I will get a review up as soon as I possibly can. I got to see the movie again just again to hope. The fix my brain. Oh, and, and as far as the frustration, like I said, it's going to bust your cost. This movie does something that normally would anger me and frustrate me to high heavens, but because I've been on this journey and I understand what they're going for, I let it slide. It, it, it earned the forgiveness. <laughs> Any other movie, I'd be just hopping mad, but this movie, it earns forgiveness. <laughs> so those are my initial first impressions of Avengers Endgame. And like I said, I will have a full review as soon as I can. In the meantime, I hope you enjoyed this video. Be sure to like, share, and subscribe, or dislike, share, and subscribe. Once again, I am High Heel Knight. Thank you for watching. And remember, find inspiration everywhere.